so about a month ago I decided to buy an open wheel because it's something my dad's always talked about and uh, it was made for a small driver so I'm a big dude so I had to open it up and uh, this is kind of going to be my journey on the upcoming year. So a lot of people that know me know that I've always been into drag racing. It's always been my my thing and I love dirt racing too. My dad always took me uh, to quite a few tracks. Uh, Crossful, Atomic before it got bulldozed down. Uh, just all kinds of places and always enjoyed it. So I ended up buying myself an open wheel and ordered me a bunch of junk because I'm trying to put it together. I bought a roller, I bought an A-Mod, and uh, I've been an LS nut. I've not messed with any small block Chevrolet junk in a long time, so I'm back into that now. So I got a flywheel, I got a balancer bolt. Got a balancer bolt. Got some flex plate bolts. Got a push rod for a fuel pump. A couple carburetor gaskets because I didn't have any. Found this cool uh, air cleaner stud. It's from Quick Latch. They do all my, or they make all the fasteners to hold my front end on my Nova. So I thought it was cool instead of losing a wing nut. And then I needed the drive flange for the Falcon that's in my car. There's a goofy block off plate and a pre-filter for the air cleaner. And then Speedway had kind of a deal. Uh, my buddy's a Holly dealer, hooks me up on stuff, but I couldn't buy the push rod the plate, the AM fittings, and the fuel pump for what Speedway had the kit for. So I could have got the, the pump a little cheaper, but by the time I bought everything, it really wouldn't have been any money savings. So. As I get some more of this junk, I'll do do some unboxings, unboxings, and uh, I got the distributor and plug wires in the other day, and then uh, got what else did I get? Oh, uh, let's see, distributor, carburetor, plug wires, and. My stupid butt ordered the wrong plug wires, so I had to order another set. And then instead of a RPM peel that I call it, I ordered the selector switch because if I change motors, I'm going to have to change peels. And they were 40 bucks, and my buddy hooked me up with a selector for like 60 So I just went ahead and went that route. It seemed to few more bucks now but less money later and about this flex plate because it's SFI rated and uh, that's the last thing I want is for it to go through my feet and what it I uh, went to MRC uh, Mayo's over in Cleveland bought a water pump um, pulleys power steering pump mount power steering pump starter breather spacer something else anyway I put all this these parts together and put a little list of all the junk that I've bought so anyway uh, hope y'all enjoy this journey and I've not got pictures of everything or videos of everything but 
I've just been a little excited here and there. I kind of forget, but thanks for checking it out. <laughs>